students really. Talking to students, you know, talking about econ. I love to talk. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I like to talk, and when you're a professor, you talk a lot. <laughs> Amazing when you see students, especially at Vanderbilt, they are smart. And I like that. Probably the most important mission of economists is to prevent policies that are wrong. For example, setting prices that are crazy. Look at an example that's Venezuela. They set the prices that are very, very low. They think that they are helping people, but economists will tell you that that's a bad policy that will really, at the end, starve people. So the most important thing is to prevent mistakes. To understand concepts more than formulas, but we have to test you on formulas. So you have to understand the concepts, although we are testing you on, you know, the formulas and mathematics of the issue. It's very important to understand why free trade is important, why free trade is good. So understand concepts, but be aware that we, you know, we test you on four plus. <laughs> Since I have a small kid, I would want to become a teacher, a kids teacher, a pre-kindergarten teacher. <laughs> It's, it's not a manly job, perhaps, but that's, that's really, uh, you know, I, 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 I doubt that I can do that, but that, that was the thing that I wanted to do, really, truly. It would be principle of macro or principle of micro. One of the two. It's very basic. The focus is on concepts. And if you understand those two, you understand, um, if you understand really those two very well, you understand 80% of uh, the econ profession. Really. <laughs>